What's going on everybody? I wanted to talk a little bit more about my lights um, before I get into that. Look at all these little stars. So yesterday I went and picked up this little Harlequin and I posted a short video of him going to town on those things within the first five hours. So I think he's going to do pretty well and clean his tank up fairly quickly. Uh, once he does, I'll probably just uh, rehome him for somebody else that has the same starfish problems. I don't know. We'll see. So my lights, my last video I told you I had uh, the three Ocean Revive Arctic T247s. They're uh, controllable on timers. I have three. I'd like to get a fourth one and possibly run them off a bluefish controller to get the sunrise sunset. But currently I have them set up in times where once they come on in the morning, this side blues will come on. 15 minutes later, this side blues will come on. 15 minutes later, this side blues will come on. And then in the same uh, fashion with the whites, the white channel. So it has kind of a sunrise, sunset-ish kind of setting with the way I set it up that way. It's a lot better in the sense of you know just a hundred percent blues all at one time so it kind of slowly turns on and moves across my tank I would much rather have that ramping option that that blue fish will give me there are not very many videos where people are using these ocean revives with those um, types of controllers so not a hundred percent sure on how to do it but I would like to give it a shot. So as you can see uh, here, I do have uh, channel one, 100% blues. Channel two is at 20% and that's my white channel. I just prefer that bluer uh, look to the tank in every single one of these are at 100% blue and 20% whites. It really just makes a lot of these corals pop. I was considering swapping out some of the whites on here with maybe a violet or a pink just to utilize that second channel a lot more because being at 20%, I just feel like it's, it's really not benefiting the tank as much as it could. So I'd like to swap them out. I do have a diagram of all the LED colors and temperatures, so I can uh, pick which ones I, I like and order them to switch them out. Uh, really, as far as just being aesthetically pleasing to my eyes, uh, that 20% is pretty much where I like it. Anything higher, it's really just kind of drowning out, you know, the colors that, you know, what it's producing with just, you know, 100% blues. So, um, not only, you know, the 100% blues and 20% whites just for looks, but these corals are growing like crazy. I'm talking, you know, uh, this digi here, you know, another branch or two every couple weeks. This guy here has exploded. I've only had it for maybe three months and it was about that size when I first got it. So, I mean, it's it's been just ridiculous. I have that piece that broke off, and then I have another piece over here that broke off. And they're growing just as fast. This ponnet uh, bird's nest has tripled in size in maybe five, six months under these LEDs. You know, Red Planet Acro back here is is growing like crazy. I had a little piece break off 
and I just glued it to the rock right there and it is just encrusting and growing like crazy. You know, those, those uh, two back rows in the back, that purple bonsai and that blue one were the first two that I had and they did uh, an awesome job. So I decided, hey, let's go ahead and just cover this whole rock in acros and see how they do. And I have I feel like um, I'm doing something right because with the lighting and just the water parameters, it's they're all doing awesome. So if you're looking for some good LEDs, I actually want to say I got these on eBay possibly, three of them for 550 bucks I believe. They are well worth it. Like I said again, I, I did find a forum using the Bluetooth or the Bluefish controller and it does provide some ramping but there was a few issues that wasn't allowing it to go 100% off. So. Um, I'm gonna see what I can do. Obviously, uh, I don't think it's gonna be anytime soon, but when I do, I'll try to make sure I I get a video up of, of me actually putting it together, possibly. Uh, we'll see.